and you thought all he did was act. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 Childish Gambino songs. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we'll be breaking down the best songs to date in the career of rapper Childish Gambino, aka Donald Glover. Number 10, R.I.P. featuring Bun B. Late ass nights come from long days, doing all the right things in the wrong ways. One of the hypest tracks off of his star studded 2012 mixtape Royalty, Childish Gambino's R.I.P. makes incredible use of the beat from Kavinsky's Night Call, which many will recognize as the opening track from Drive. Rest in peace to the who was dead wrong. Tony Braxton to the that's a sad song. Complimented, or perhaps overshadowed by, Bun B's stellar first verse, the song is a thumping, pulsating, rip roaring roller coaster of a track that both rappers absolutely kill it on. And now break your face with a no look pass. Now back to your parking lot, pimp with your little hook gas. We dare you to try and remain still while listening to this song. Oh, and just in case you were wondering, the rest of royalty is equally impressive. All she needed was some. Number nine. The Worst Guys featuring Chance the Rapper. At a Clippers game on the court side. side. Watch it shoot like a four five. Five. One of Because the Internet's best tracks, The Worst Guys is easily one of the album's most laid back tunes, something that is truly hammered home when you watch Gambino and Chance the Rapper chilling on a beach with their friends in the music video. While Chance's inclusion on a Gambino track would usually cause us to jump for joy, his contribution to this song is relegated to him repeating the words, all she needed was some, over and over. However, seeing as how the song still delivers a great flow backed by an easygoing beat, we don't really mind. Number 8. Sober. One of the songs off of his 2014 dual release mixtape slash EP, Station Mountain Kauai, Sober is perhaps its most memorable track. The song provides us with a little insight into the mind of the seemingly heartbroken childish Gambino, lamenting a recent loss with lyrics like, Now that it's over, I'll never be sober. And, If you just give me some time, I can open up your mind. When you know it's got to be something wonderful to me. Oh, honey, now, girl. The music video features some top-notch dance moves from the Atlanta native, as he prances around a restaurant trying to impress a female patron. Sober's catchy beat and simple premise make it a whole lot of fun to listen to. Number 7. Sweatpants featuring Problem Watching haters wonder why Gambino got the game, yeah? Gambino had no problem heaping a little praise on himself on this track, casually dropping lyrics like, I got a penthouse on both coasts, and don't be mad because I'm doing me better than you doing you. Don't be mad because I'm doing me better than you doing you, better than you doing you. It's clear he's having fun with Sweatpants' funky, looping beat, with loads of pop culture references and self-deprecating humor from start to finish. The song, which served as Because the Internet's third single, made it to number 35 on the hot R&B slash hip-hop songs chart, a testament to its status as a smooth-flowing, lyrically gifted rap treat. Tripping off of them toadstools, more green than my Whole Foods, and I'm too fly, Jeff Goldblum, got a glass house in the Palisades, that AKA. Number 6, Bonfire. The lead single off of Camp, Bonfire is built around a fast-paced beat and peppered with fierce, hard-hitting lyrics that Gambino spits with the clarity of a seasoned vet. His flow on this track is straight fire, rising and falling in perfect unison with Bonfire's uber-catchy beat. I make the beat retarded, so I'm calling it a slow jam. Butcher and I know it, man. Kill beat, go ham. Gambino's wit and self-referential humor is out in full force with lyrics such as, Man, why does every black actor gotta rap some? I don't know, all I know is I'm the best one. It's lines like that that prove Gambino is the kind of rapper the world needs more of. One who has the balls to call himself out and the confidence to say, I don't care. And I'll give you all of me until there's nothing left. I swear this summer will be summer camp, bitch. Number five, Me and Your Mama. The first single released off of his critically acclaimed and Grammy-nominated third studio album, Awaken My Love, Me and Your Mama is easily one of Childish Gambino's most impressive vocal performances to date. Yeah, 
Peaking at 68 on the US Billboard Hot 100, the song starts off with a dreamy, psychedelic beat, but flips the script two minutes in, essentially turning into a rock and roll soul fusion, brought to dramatic life thanks to Gambino's raspy, screeching vocals. It's songs like this one that helped make Awaken My Love one of the year's most successful albums. Number 4. Heartbeat When this song dropped back in 2011, it was quite the change of pace for the admittedly new to the scene Childish Gambino. Whereas most of his previous work could be best described as pure rap, Heartbeat was different. The song starts off relatively slow, with a solemn piano riff and some soft-spoken lyrics. However, it picks up steam around the 50-second mark, and from that point on, it's clear we're in EDM territory. You walk around naked, I might just text you. Turn your phone over, when it's all over. It was a bold move for the young up-and-comer, but it paid off, with the song being certified platinum shortly after its release. Are we best friends? Are we something in between that? I wish we never f***ed and I mean that. But not really. Number 3. 3005 No matter what you say or what you do When I'm alone I'd rather be with you A critical and commercial success, 3005 is a shining example of Childish Gambino's skills as a writer, rapper, and producer. Nominated for Best Rap Performance at the 57th Annual Grammy Awards, the song juxtaposes some deeply personal storytelling from Glover with a futuristic, highly addictive beat. And when I'm long gone, whole crew singing swan song, cause we all just ticking time bombs, got a Lambo like LeBron's mom. Peaking at number 64 on the Billboard Hot 100, 3005 was, for a time, the rapper's most popular track. And to date, its accompanying music video has upwards of 125 million views on YouTube. A brilliant mixture of wit and insight, this track is Childish Gambino through and through. Hello. 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 Number 2. Freaks and Geeks. All right, Gambino is a mastermind. A bitch to pass the, time. the song that announced his presence to the rap world with a bang, Freaks and Geeks is impossible to listen to without your heart rate rising dramatically. Featured on Gambino's first ever EP, appropriately titled EP, the song demonstrated two of the rapper's now widely recognized trademarks, a rapid-fire flow and wit-laced lyrics. The song was proof that the man previously known only as Donald Glover, the actor, was actually a badass rapper who could spit bars with the best of them. As he rips his way through Freaks and Geeks' verses, Childish Gambino proves his worthiness as a rapper, demanding, and rightfully so, to be taken seriously. Yeah, this beat is made from concentrate. Can't you tell that my sample of Adele was so hot I got these hood blowing up my cell? Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. And we can do the same thing if you want to have it and when your thoughts can't breathe and you're thinking asthmatic and you want to be a mom and I wasn't mad at it, I was thinking about me. I'd be really bad at it because I'm thinking about me. Number 1. Redbone An incredible vocal performance and a smooth fusion of multiple musical genres turned this into one of the most popular tracks of 2017. It's hard to put a finger on why exactly Redbone is so damn good. Is it the trippy, soulful beat? Gambino's newly discovered vocal range? Both? Either way, we're more than happy to bob our heads along to the instrumentals as the silky smooth lyrics wash over us. Cracking music charts all over the world and receiving lots of Grammy love, it's pretty clear that Redbone is far and away Childish Gambino's most successful song to date. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other